Eight, the number of Bahamian cadets currently attending the State University of New York Maritime College. The students were a part of the crew of the Empire State 7, its training ship owned by the United States Maritime Administration and operated by SUNY Maritime College. The cadets excited about the experience. Well, obviously, I want to come back home and I want to help the maritime industry expand, seeing that this is a very important industry for us in terms of tourism and trade and imports and exports. So um, I definitely want to be a part of all of that. Dillard Thomas is thrilled to follow in his family's footsteps in the maritime industry. The McLeanstown Grand Bahama native is one of eight Bahamian cadets aboard the Empire State 7 vessel operated by SUNY Maritime College. I graduated in two years, so as you mentioned, more job, more opportunities. So it looks like a bright future for me and the many other pilots coming into the Freeport Harbor Company. Fellow Grand Bahamian Jules Seymour says so far his experience has been phenomenal. A reception held on board the vessel this past Thursday with John Canoe welcoming the group. Energy and Transport Minister Joe Beth Kobe Davis toured the vessel and offered this advice to cadets. To make the best of this significant opportunity that you have been afforded, please know that the mentoring and networking opening are the very best and that the world awaits and needs your contribution. And with the maritime field driving the global economy, Colby Davis explained how the Bahamas stacks up. The Bahamas stands as a clear example of the growth that the maritime industry is experiencing. Our country's ship registry is the eighth largest in the world and comprises over 1,500 ships, totaling more than 63 million gross tonnage. It is also the largest flag for passenger ships and one of the largest for gas carriers. A special presentation made to the captain and other officials pleased with the call to the port of Nassau. This turned out to be the first foreign port that this brand new ship has gone to. Woo! It won't be the last time we're here. Um, the, the relationship with the Bahamas goes back, someone told me last night, almost 50 years. Captain Robert Cook is a SUNY Maritime College alumni and also the co-founder of the Organization of Black Maritime Graduates, who for the past 30 years has been working with youth, particularly minorities, affording them opportunities in the maritime field. We have encouraged our cadets. We have worked alongside our partners at Maritime College. We have worked in the Bahamas. We have worked in Nigeria. We have worked globally to make this come to fruition. This is important. It's significant. The future is in these young men's and women's hands. Hello, everyone. I'm Fern Carey. Thank you for watching our YouTube page. Be sure to like comment and subscribe for all things said and asked.